Idaho Commission for the Blind and Visually Impaired. Empowering blind and visually impaired Idahoans to achieve self-fulfillment by providing quality vocational rehabilitation and independent living services since 1967. Assistive Technology. Hi, I'm Brenda and I want to show you today how to use the magnifier that is built into your computer. When the computer screen is hard to see, magnification can be helpful. Today I'm going to show you how to turn on the magnifier, how to increase the magnification, how to decrease the magnification, and how to exit the magnifier using your keyboard. We are going to use four keys in the key commands. The Windows key, which is on the bottom row, usually the second or third key in from the left. It is a white rectangle divided into fours, looking like a window pane. The second key that we'll use is the plus key, and it can be found in two different areas. On the number row, just left of the backspace, and on the number pad on the far right, usually the second key up from the bottom. Third one is the minus key and that can be located also in two spots on the keyboard and one is on the number row just left of the plus key or on the number pad above the plus key. And the last key that we use is escape and that is the far top left. We use a combination of these keys. Windows key is used in every one of the combinations. I'm going to demonstrate using the magnifier with the key commands. So I'm going to press down the Windows key and I'm going to do a quick press on the plus. That turns on the magnifier. Now if I want to increase it more in magnification, I'm going to hold down the Windows key and quick press on the plus. Each plus is bringing it up in increments of magnification. So to decrease magnification, I'm going to hold down the Windows key and do quick presses on the minus. Each press is bringing it down in increments of magnification. If I wanted to zoom up in magnification, I hold down the Windows key and hold down the plus key. When I lift up the plus key, it will stop at that. When I lift my finger up off the plus key, it'll stop at that magnification level. And I lift my finger up. Same thing with decreasing magnification. I can zoom down in magnification by holding down the Windows key and holding down the minus key lifting up my, mine, my finger off the minus key and it stops at that magnification level. To exit the magnifier, I hold down the Windows key and press the Escape key. And that turns off the magnifier. The magnifier will remember the level of magnification that you had at the time you turn it off. So when I turn it back on with holding down the Windows key and the plus key, turns the magnifier back on at the level of magnification that I turned it off at. So with magnification on, you are only seeing a portion of the screen at a time. To see the right side of the screen, you move your mouse pointer and the focus will follow your mouse pointer. There's my right side of the screen. If I go down, there's my taskbar at the bottom. When the magnifier is running, you will have an icon on your taskbar that looks like a computer monitor with a magnifier in the left, bottom left corner. So if any reason that you get your magnification down so far that you don't notice that it's on or off, that icon will be showing you that it is on if it is in the taskbar. A couple of things I want to show you about using the magnifier. Um, on the web, I open my Chrome here. You can tell that everything is larger at the top. I can increase with the Windows key and the quick press on the plus, and that increased it. I'm going to go to a website. This is the Idaho Commission for the Blind website. Now, as I move my mouse pointer down, I'm going to come out of my uh, browser window, and I'm back on my desktop, and there's my taskbar. So when you're in the web, not all the content is going to show in uh, the browser window and you have to change to scroll. You can use the scroll wheel on your mouse or you can use the scroll bars are on the far right of your browser window. 
Also, another thing to show you is uh, the focus will follow the text. When you're typing text, this is my word. Uh, there's the ribbons, everything is larger. If I wanted to close it, I'd move my mouse clear to the right side to find that X to close it. There's my cursor, and um, so my focus is getting to, going to follow. So you can see there that um, my cursor, uh, focus of the magnifier followed the text as I typed. And then when I want to close this out, my focus will follow to the message boxes that pop up. And that's how you can use the magnifier. To review the magnifier keyboard commands that we went over today, turn on the magnifier with Windows key plus key. To increase magnification, Windows key and plus key. To decrease magnification, Windows key and minus key. To turn off the magnifier, Windows key and escape. We hope that you've enjoyed this presentation. For more information, please visit our website at www.icbvi.io.gov or call us at 208-334-3220.